नेक्स्ट क्वेश्चन एन आइसोलेटेड चेम्बर इज डिवाइडेड इन टू टू हाफ्स बाय पार्टीशन विद एन आइडियल गैस इन वन हाफ बाई मेकिंग अ होल इन द पार्टीशन द गैस इज अलाउड टू एक्सपैंड टू द फुल चेम्बर अमंग द फॉलोइंग द पैरामीटर विच चेंजेस इन द प्रोसेस इज अ वेरी सिंपल क्वेश्चन एक्चुअली सो यू हैव दिस चेम्बर एंड इन वन हाफ देर इज एन आइडियल गैस ए फॉर एग्जाम्पल now we have made a pin hole in this chamber uh, in this partition so, so the gas will be expanding in the entire chamber in this process uh, there is because the gas is ideal right so there is there is no attractive force between the particles so there won't be any work done required in this process of expansion so work done would be zero because it is isolated so heat is not flowing in or out so heat would be zero and from the first law of thermodynamics delta u which is equal to q plus w as both q and w are zero delta u will also be zero that means temperature change will also be zero so change in temperature would be u won't be changing t won't be changing q won't uh, q is zero and work done is also zero but as the volume is increased number of moles of gas is constant temperature is constant but volume is increasing so using pv is equal to nrt you can very well see that number of moles are constant r is constant t is constant but v is increasing and if v is increasing which means p would decrease so there would be decrease in the pressure of this gas so the only parameter that is changing out of the given options is pressure so the correct answer for this question would be option d please remember that if the gas would uh, if the gas is real gas then work done won't be zero because in a real gas there is attractive force between the particles so if the gas is expanded uh, the th there will be some work involved and that work energy required to do that work will be taken out from its internal energy only so delta u would be negative in that case uh, th uh, that means t would also change in that case but here as the gas is ideal so there is no work so only pressure would change